So it feels good knowing that I'm able to get 180, 185, 190, for just no more um, wondering why some of my throws go 140 when it feels like I'm throwing my hardest and the other ones go 160, 170, sometimes 180, right? <laughs> now I know why. All right, so I'm out here at University of Maryland golf course. I just came from the driving range, which you can see back there. <laughs> Breakthrough. Let me just say that. Breakthrough. Had a had a had a major major breakthrough when it comes to getting distance with the with my with my initial drive. And that breakthrough number one came from watching um Ken watching Ken swing over and over again and believe it or not watching disc golf disc golf players you know throw the disc and I realized the commonality was that I'm gonna sit down here a commonality was that they were all using a lot of body right there was a lot of um, the the arms were way back either either over the shoulder or across, across the body and over the shoulder uh, Ken has a lot of body rotation right when he winds up and also um, disc golf players they almost have their back a lot of times to the to the basket when they're you know or to the target on the initial drop like when they when they swing and I'll put up some um, clips of that but they turn around a lot they have a lot of rotation to the point where for a split second they can't even see the target <laughs> right that's how that's how that's how far they're um they're rotating with their swing and and you can and you can see this also in traditional golf right the um, the pros who hit very very long they have the most flexibility Right when that left shoulder come back, I'm talking about righties, righties here, right, right-handed people. When they bring that that left shoulder extension back, it it extends a long way, and then they and, and plus the body rotation and the twist. I mean, they have a lot of range of motion there. They're very flexible, and so the further back you are, the more time that you have for that swing to pick up speed. Also, when you're using the big muscles in your body, the big muscles are stronger than the strong than the small muscles, right? So, at first, I was using a whole lot of arms. I was using almost nothing but arms, and my shoulders would be sore, right? After 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 a few of my hardest swings, I just came from swing, uh, throwing 65 balls, and I am not sore at all. N not it feels like I'm still fresh, <laughs> right? Because I was using more of my body and 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 really extended my arms way back over my shoulder across my body as far as I really as far as I could right now I assume that if I was even more flexible I can go even further back doing that I was able to get my carry distance right and I'm, I'm measuring the distance from me to the uh, blue flag which was 187 and some of my throws were carrying to that flag to 187 and then rolling past it <laughs> right so they and they had to be a good 10 more yards past it right so probably a good 190 195 now i was a little i was on the grassy part of the range which was probably about five yards ahead of the regular t of the t box there so you know minus five yards or whatever is fine right um, so I'm, I have no doubt that some of those balls rolled out to a good 195 yards, um, close to 200, right, on, on, on the uh, final distance, not the carry. Carry, um, a lot of my carries were falling right around 170-ish and then rolling out to 185, 190. So, I mean, that's basically the answer. Full arm extension way back. Right, and I, t I, t I tilt. So like, you know, I saw which 
how my stick was going to be rotated when I released it and I left it just like that when I brought it out to the side so to, so so that the the head was kind of angled or tilted a, a bit forward it wasn't pointing straight up right it's tilted a bit forward so that by the time I wind up I don't have to twist it I don't have to turn it or anything it's already straight man if it, it felt great um, it felt it feels good knowing that I'm able to get 180 185 190 you know as long as as long as I'm swinging that way right I know what I have to do now it's no it's no more guessing work it's no more um, wondering why some of my throws go 140 when it feels like I'm throwing my hardest and the other ones go 160 170 sometimes 180 right <laughs> now I know why now I know why it's that arm extension it's that twisting of the body it's that using the big muscles of the body to really get that forward motion and put that power behind the throw major major i'm loving it i'm i'm elated right now so i can't wait i was going to go to the golf course today i'm glad i didn't um because i got this i got my swing down i got my swing down um as far as distance goes i still still need to kind of sort of work on direction a bit more but i mean hey that's everybody right um or well, most people, I should say. Um, so yeah, that's about it. I fling off of Sunny. Please like, comment, subscribe. I fling off of Sunny out.